Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you guys have never been here before, my name is China, and if you have, once again, welcome back. So guys, obviously this is a little bit different. I'm actually trying to make sure I'm within the finder and everything. I really was inspired to do this because I am really into skincare. I wouldn't say that I'm super, super into it, I guess. I would just say that I'm very like, I want to learn how to bring out those qualities in my skin or like just in my like features and everything naturally and on a day-to-day -day basis without having to apply like makeup and stuff like that. So for me, I'm lazy and I don't really like doing all of the makeup. Um, it gets frustrating after a while. I don't like sweating under the makeup. I don't like having to remove it. I don't like having to do any of that. And then on my day-to-day -day basis, when I go into work, I wake up super early and like putting on makeup is just not what I want to do. I actually um, looked into Fenty Skin. So guys, I just got back from Sephora. Me and hubby went to Sephora, we went to the mall, and I just got some goodies from Sephora. And I looked up some things on Fenty, just like some natural, just like, I don't know, just like brightening things that you could add to your skincare routine and stuff. I looked at the reviews, I saw great reviews. So that's what I'm gonna be doing today. I have not tried these products yet, this is how I'm looking right now with just like my regular skincare routine, but I wanted to see if I could add something in that would make it just like me like pop on a day-to-day -day basis, you know, just like just naturally glow. So first thing is this, the Fenty Skin Total Cleanser. Um, I have a cleanser right now that I use. It's like from the drugstore and it's really good for like sensitive skin. I have more sensitive skin and dry skin, um, except for my nose, it gets really um, oily. So I'm a little, you know, I, I kind of debated whether I was gonna even get this or not just because I feel like I have a good cleanser, you know, that doesn't irritate my skin, but we're gonna try this. So this is the first um, product that we're gonna be using. Next product is this Fenty Skin Toner. So it says, Pore Refining Toner Serum Fat Water. Um, so I noticed that there were two of these. There was like a milky toner and then there was this toner. I think this one was the one with like Barbados Cherry or something like that in it. But I saw that this one had a lot of good reviews so, and I, and I don't have a toner right now. I actually ran out of my last one. So I was like, you know, let me just try the toner. So this will be the next product. And then I'm actually really excited about this one. This one had a lot of great reviews as well. This is the Hydrovisor by Fenty Skin. So um, I actually uh, used some on my hand and it was very moisturizing. I, I saw that it was very like glowy too. It added like a glow to my hand. So I'm excited to see how this will work on my face. It's supposed to have like SPF in it as well well, but an invisible moisturizer, broad spectrum SPF 30 sunscreen. So this one will be my moisturizer. Final product is the Cherry Treat Conditioning Lip Oil. So this one here, lots of great reviews as well. I actually put this on in the car because I was so excited. So I, I kind of have already tried this product, uh, but I can't say much about it just because, I mean, I I literally just put it on and I took it off just to, you know, for this video, but um, yeah, Cherry Treat Conditioning Lip Oil. So it's supposed to like condition lips, soften lips. My lips have been super dry because it's so cold. So I'm excited to see how this will work for my lips over time. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and try these products on. Um, this is a first for me as well. So this really is not a review or anything. This is just to see how my face changes and if this can be something that I just add to my daily regimen and I can just walk out the house feel great and all those kind of good things so let's get into it I know I got a lot of work to do baby I'm not perfect but I know I'm worth it working out my issues with you with you as I already say like this smells really good I don't know, it's like, it's a slight smell, but it smells kind of like sweet. I don't know if it's scented. Um, I don't typically do scented uh, cleansers, but we'll see. Oh, okay. 
So I can say immediately with the cleanser, this is what I'm looking like right after I did the cleanser. Um, and I'll have to let it sit for just like a little bit because it doesn't feel like heavy or like drying to my face or anything. So that's good. I don't know if there's fragrance in it or if that's just like the natural oils or what, but it did smell a little bit like sweet. So, but for right now, like I'm liking, I'm liking what I'm seeing so far. So now I'm going to go ahead and do the toner. And then for the toner, it does say that you can apply it with your hands. It does say like apply it with your hands, I believe. Yeah, I think it says apply it with your hands, but I'm a little, I wanna be bougie. So I'm gonna use a cotton pad. Get on there. Okay, so this is after I just applied the toner. Um, it does have, it feels kind of sticky. Feels like a little bit sticky. I don't get like a, I don't really get like a smell in this one. So I'm not sure, but I'm not getting like the same smell that I, I smelled in the first one. If it is a fragrance in it, it's very light. So this is the toner. This is what I'm looking like with the toner. I feel like I've had like skin brightening toners in the past that like really, really, like as soon as I put it on, it has like the hyaluronic acid in it. I think that was the milky toner. This one is like a little bit different. I'm not seeing like the same like super, super bright, brightening hyaluronic acid type of feel, but you know, it doesn't feel bad. It just feels a little bit, like a little bit, a uh, little bit sticky. So um, yes, now we're gonna go ahead and apply my moisturizer and then my cherry lip conditioning oil. It actually says to apply liberally 15 minutes before sun exposure. And then it says re reapply at least every two hours, which I'm like, okay, I'm probably not gonna do that like realistically. It's like a little pumpy here, little pumpy. It's coming, it's coming. It says liberally, I don't really know what liberally means. I don't know if that means like a lot or just, oh, it feels like I grabbed a lot. Ooh, it feels like I grabbed a lot, Jesus. I put a lot. Wasting product already, okay. Maybe not. Let's see, let's put it all on there and just see what happens. <laughs> This one I can kind of smell something too, but it smells more like a, like a skincare product. So, you know, like it has that smell, like just like a, a bougie skincare lotion or something. I hope it kind of settles into my skin because right now this is what I'm looking like. Ooh. Gotta get the neck, yeah. I think I just, I think maybe liberally meant just be careful maybe. Okay, so I just finished applying the moisturizer. Um, it did seem like I put quite a bit on, but I'm not gonna lie. It looks like it just kind of soaked into my skin. Like I can definitely see that glow and it's definitely like my skin is really moisturized. I'm liking it so far. I like the look that it gives me. This is how I would like to like go out, like kind of glowing. Um, I just don't want to look oily. I don't really know. Y'all let me know if you feel like I look super oily. I'm not sure, but just like giving my skin some life and looking awake and alive but I like that I feel like I put a lot on my skin and it started off like kind of white and then it feels like it just kind of soaked in it didn't take me very long to rub it into my skin so it seems like it just kind of settled now we're going to go ahead and use our cherry lip oil and then we're just going to see how we look at the end okay, so here's our cherry treat boop, boop. I actually have this oh this bump right here I'm yeah And I'm sorry guys, I'm looking into my viewfinder a lot because I honestly don't know how I could have set it up. And I probably should be facing the mirror, but I'm not. Y'all should let me know how to position my camera because I was in here fighting with the camera trying to figure out how to even, you know, make it make sense. Okay, oh, and I just let my hair down. Okay guys, so this is the final. I know that that cherry lip thing, I really like that. That has a smell to me too, but it's not like, prominent it smells like there could be some type of like cherry scent i'm not super into cherry scents but it's it's not like overwhelming or anything like that um as far as like it conditioning and stuff i just have to experiment more with it it does feel like it is it's no like feeling necessarily it just feels a little bit thick um and 
I don't know, it just feels like a little bit thick right now. So, and it obviously gives my, my lips a shine. So I do like that. I feel like I could just wear it. I didn't know if I would have to like put a gloss or something over it, but this is like my final like walkout phase. I just want to live freely right now. <laughs> I don't want to have stuff on my face. I just want things that really enhance and just kind of make my, my skin look fresh and alive. Um, kind of something that works on my under eye circle. So I'm looking for something for that. If you guys have ideas, please leave them down in, in the comments to see, cause I'm looking for something for these under eye circles. This is me. This is what Fenty Skin, this is like literally what it would look like. Um, my day to day, I just use that whole, like the whole set. So um, I don't know, you guys tell me what you think. I'm gonna be using it regularly. Um, I don't feel like any irritations or anything from the products. So I'm hoping that, you know, like they can stay in my routine. Guys, that's going to be the end of today's video. If you guys have tried any of these products, please leave, like, let me know your thoughts down below. I saw like great reviews, but if you guys have anything, leave it down below. Um, suggestions or things that you want me to try. I know that I basically talk about fragrances, but guys, like skincare is another big thing for me. It's like, it's a big thing. So um, just let me know your thoughts below and I will see you guys next time. Bye.